Hi, I welcome you to this live training. My name is Timothy Matley. In this training, I'll be showing you everything you need to know about Revit Tutorial Masterclass. And I'd like you to be very, very focused. Avoid any distraction. Whatever device you are using to attend this training, that should be your focus for now. Avoid any environment that is going to distract you so that you don't lose any part of this training today. And I'd like you to stay to the end of this training because at the end of this training, I'm going to be showing you something very important in Revit that you may have not known before. And before I continue, I want to confirm that you are hearing me. In case you are hearing me and you can see me, I'd like you to type Revit Tutorial in the comment section. I want to confirm that you guys can hear me and you can see me. If you can hear me and you can see me, type Revit in the comment section. All right, all right. Okay, Stephen can hear me. All right, that is very good. Now we can continue. I'm going to be showing you briefly how to use Revit architecture to model buildings step by step. And this method is going to work for you even though you have never used Revit before. You don't need the knowledge of AutoCAD to use Revit. These are some of my models. I use Revit to model all these. I use Revit to model this interior design. That is one of my works. This is actually an, an animation. So I want to play the animation now so that you can see. My expectation for you is that if you can stay with me till the end of my course, you should be able to produce something like this. Though I want to explain to you that only Revit alone cannot produce this. You need a combination of Revit and Lumion to be able to produce animation like this. But it is Revit you use in modeling before you can produce animation in Lumion. All right, this is one of my students that produced this just a few days after gaining access to Revit Tutorial Masterclass and Lumion. This is his interior also. Before we continue, who is this training for? This training is for architects who want to learn how to model buildings for their clients to have an aesthetic overview of their proposed building before construction. This training is for interior designers who want to design the interior for their clients. This training is for civil engineers. This training is for builders. This training is for students of architecture in various schools. This training is for you if you are looking for any architectural software that will produce 3D and complete working drawing all in one place. With Revit Architecture, you will be able to produce complete detailed drawing. You don't need AutoCAD for this. Only Revit alone can give you detailed architectural drawings this is one of my 3d i use revit to model this and use lumion to render it this is one of my design as well i use revit to model all these and use lumion to render it this is another design of mine model with revit architecture this is another design 
everything model with Revit architecture. And this is from one of my students. He used Revit architecture to model this. This is another student of mine as well. He also used Revit to model this. My big promise for you is that you too can achieve the same result and even better result if you can stay with me to the end of my course. All right. What is the relationship between animation and Revit? It is very simple. We use Revit to model our 3Ds while we use Lumion to produce high quality rendering and animation. All right. This is one of my exterior animation. The one I showed you before was interior animation. Now this is an exterior animation. Let me play it. Like I told you before, you can use Revit to model it, then use Lumion to produce the animation. Quickly, let me show you how to use Revit architecture. If you have Revit installed on your computer, all you need to do is to go to the icon on your desktop. The one I want to use today is Revit 2019. So all I need to do is to right click on it and click on open and wait for it to load. While it is loading, if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, ensure you click on that button below to subscribe to this channel. On this channel, I create content on how to use Revit architecture. So if that is the kind of knowledge you want, why not subscribe and ring the notification bell so that anytime I upload videos about Revit architecture, you'll be notified. All right, with that out of the way, my Revit is opened now. And these are the projects I've worked on in the past. I want to open this particular one, so I'm going to double click on it and let's wait for it to load. I believe you guys are still seeing me. In case you are no longer seeing me, indicate in the comment section. And if you have any question, write your question down because I am going to be answering all your questions at the end of this training. All right, now we have opened our Revit and this is one of the projects we did in the past in one of our live training. And today, I want to see how we can place windows in this project. This is the ground floor plan. And right now I am on ground floor. So to place my window, there are several ways I can go around it. I can go to architecture tab, select window. And here it will automatically give me some windows that are here. To give me some windows that are here and if peradventure there are no windows here if you do not see the type of window you are looking for here all you need to do is to click on load family doing that it will take you to your revit folders family folders you click on this drop down and go up a little bit you will now see libraries double click on that library and you will see us imperial us metric 
depends on the one you want to use if I want to use US metric I double click on that and look for window double click on it again and here we have one type of window is not enough so I'm going to go to US Imperial where I can see more window there US Imperial I'll go to window double click on it uh -huh. now we have different types of windows here we have different types so it depends on the one you want let's check this one and see open okay is active now and this is the name let me place it here okay now let's check the size you select it go to your property palette edit type and look at the parameters the width is 1219 okay i can decide to change it direct i will make it 1200 mm that is the the width what about the height the height should be something like 1800 mm and that is the only thing i need to set for now so i'm going to click apply there are some times we duplicate it if you don't want to tamper with the existing one okay so i'm going to select it and select create similar and place it here just continue to place them and place all of them anywhere that you have that same type of window place them there uh, this is our bedroom so the, the bedroom need the same type of window I'm going to place this one then for this one you can see it cannot enter here okay and we have placed it on the most important ones we need it in our laundry okay let me put it let me place it in our laundry and we have our store here toilet here and visitor wc here and we have our ante room so this particular one is too big for our toilet so what we are going to do is we are going to select it create similar and we are going to go to property palette edit type and now we are going to duplicate it the reason we are going to duplicate it is so that it doesn't affect our original version it doesn't affect the other one okay so you duplicate it and give it a name let's see um, this particular one is toilet window toilet w and the size is 600 mm by 600 mm and you click ok now you are going to change the parameter to 600 mm and the width to 600 mm and click ok now you can place it in your toilet now okay that is your toilet place it there and place it on all those places you need small windows all right those are the places we need small windows and this anti room we need a small window but not as small as that of toilet so i'm going to select this toilet own and create similar 
Then I'm going to duplicate it again. I'll go to property palette, edit type, duplicate, and this time around, I'm going to um, let's say anti window. The size will be one thousand eight hundred by by seven fifty by seven fifty. 750 and I'm going to delete this tool and click OK then change the width the height to 1800 then the width to 750 and click OK so we are going to place it here now and that is our window in the ante room okay so we have been able to place our windows in our project okay so that is how you place your windows in your project there are so many other things we need to do we cannot finish everything in this video alone as a professional, one of the most important things you need is skill. You need to be very skillful at whatever you are doing. That is what is going to sell you to your world. But let me ask you this question. Would you like to acquire a skill that can help you get a salary job that can pay you at least 250k per month? Would you like to acquire a skill that can help you get a contract that can pay you up to 1 million to 10 million profit? Would you like to acquire a skill that can help you stop hearing I will get back to you from clients or your employers? When your clients or your employer tells you that I will get back to you, there are reasons for that. It could be that he doesn't really like your presentation. Um, in order to give you a soft landing, he will tell you that I will get back to you. And most of the time, they never get back. So to be able to reduce the number of I will get back to you, the most important thing you need to do is to increase your skill. When you have increased your skill, you will be able to produce what they will like. And if they like you, they like your job then what is going to prevent them from giving you the job? Let me ask you another question. Would you like not to work as a successful freelancer? A freelancer is someone that can work from home and work for anyone from any part of the world. But before you can be a good freelancer, you must be very skillful. Would you not like to be the one in charge and you charge your professional fees without looking back or do you prefer to be at the mercy of few clients who detect the amount they are going to pay you? Would you like to work for kings and royalty, people that matters in the society? Would you like to move from the bottom of the ladder where there are too much competition and move to the top where there are few competitors? Would you like to be an expensive professional that can charge high price, like one million naira for a single drawing, and your clients will be ready to pay you? Do you still want to be carrying files up and down and looking for jobs instead of employers calling you and you dictate your price? Now here is me here. The knowledge of Revit and Lumion have taken me to several places which otherwise I wouldn't have been able to go there. But with Revit, I have gotten several jobs, several drawings. I've met with high-paying clients from different parts of the world. That is what Revit, the knowledge of Revit can do. That could also be your own story too. You need the following to be able to learn Revit successfully. 
one of the things you need is you need a computer very very important a lot of people always ask me that can they use phone and the answer is no you cannot install Revit on phone right and the minimum capacity of computer you need is 4 gig RAM and above the higher the RAM the better if you can get 16 gig RAM that is better if you can get 8 gig RAM is also good but the minimum I would recommend is 4 gig this is one of the questions that a lot of people always ask me and thank God we are in this training today all right then the hard disk I would recommend is 300 gigabytes and above if you can get 500 gigabytes one terabyte that is the best the higher the better and the higher the more expensive the system will be and Revit must be installed on that particular computer you want to use and one of the questions that a lot of people always ask me that how can I get Revit software? If you are in this training, you may not bother yourself about how to get Revit software because at the end of this training, I'm going to be showing you how you can get Revit software. So ensure that you stay with me to the end of this training and I will show you how to get Revit software. Another important thing you need to have to be able to learn Revit successfully is you must know how to operate computer at least you should be able to boot your computer you should be able to shut down your computer you should be able to type few things on the keyboard hold your mouse and be able to move your mouse so these are the some of the things you need and you also need internet connection you need to connect your laptop to internet so that you'll be able to get some things from the internet. It is very, very important. And you must understand English language, at least basic English language, because it is English language that we use in communication. And you also need basic knowledge of architectural designs and planning. A lot of people contact me and they say they have never learned architecture before and they are interested in this training. And I always ask them that here we do not teach you the rudiments of architecture. Architecture is a different thing and the use of Revit is another different thing. It is believed that you have studied architecture from school. So what you are using Revit for is to interpret your architectural skill into computer that can be printed. So we are not teaching architecture here. We teach you how to use Revit. So I want to believe that you have gone to school and studied architecture. So what is left now is how to practicalize it. Instead of using drawing board, we are now using computer. This is one of my students, Yakub Abu. He said, thank you for making huge impact sharpening professionals. Though my job demands has kept me watching your various tutorial videos, I'm greatly inspired. I'm proud of you, sir. God bless you, sir. All right? This is another student of mine, Christian. Christian said, thanks. And Emmanuel say, God bless you, sir. And Godfrey said, thank you, sir. You are such a great personality. Another student of mine, Alfred, said, hello, boss. God bless you for all your effort towards the training. Through your teaching, I have learned a lot, even outside Revit and Lumion. Thanks a lot. I pray that God will bless you, all your students. Here is another student of mine, Alfred Great Holmes. He said, 
Hello boss, God bless you for all your effort towards the training. Through your teaching, I have learned a lot even outside Revit and Lumion. Thanks a lot, sir. I pray that God will bless all your students and touch their heart to show appreciation for your effort. You are a good teacher. Okay? And um, this is another student of mine. Let me this one is a video, so I'm going to play the video now so that you will hear her yourself. Let me play the video. Hello, good evening. My name is Lori Uko and I am a civil engineer. Two months ago I registered for the Revit tutorial masterclass by Mr. Timothy Omatuli and I can say that this class is very easy to understand. The videos are very easy and straight to the point. I have been able to finish a project. I will put it out on the group soon. I started um, learning Revit while I was an undergraduate back in school, but at some point I stopped. I didn't continue with my training. I moved on to use other software programs like Orion for my structural designs and Start Pro. So I decided to refresh my memory by brushing up my skills in Revit. And I saw um, this advertisement online and I registered for it. At first I was a bit skeptical, but after I registered, I was added to a support group where you are free to ask questions and get support from Mr. Timothy himself and other class um, members as well. This group is very supportive and the videos are so easy to understand. I haven't even asked a question on the group yet because the videos are straight to the point, easy to understand and you know, I've been able to create a project which I'll be putting out as I said earlier. So I would advise anyone who is looking to learn a design skill, whether you're an architect, a civil engineer, or you're into the interior decoration, interior designs, whatever around this field, I would advise you get this course and it will be really, really valuable for you. Thank you. Bye. Okay, that is Gloria. That is the testimonial from Gloria. You have heard her. That was her experience with my training. And this is one of my students that produced these. He used Revit to model these and he rendered it with Lumion. Okay, this is another project of mine. I use Revit to model these. At this point, you have a choice to make. You have two choices to make. The hard way. Now, what is the hard way? The hard way is you can just choose to be your own mentor. And you can see several videos on how to use Revit on YouTube, on Google, on Facebook. And you can keep browsing on YouTube and keep watching those videos. And anytime you have issue, when you are using Revit, you have issue, you simply browse on, on YouTube. And by the time you watch up to five videos, or at most 10 videos, you would have gotten the answer you are looking for. Now, the hard part of it is that Sometimes you are going to see videos that don't really answer your question and you end up wasting your time. And sometimes you are looking for a particular question and the video that comes up end up not speaking English that you can understand. I have been there before and I am talking from experience. So the job you are expected to deliver as quick as possible you will be whiling away time doing research instead of going straight to solving problem. 
Okay, now let's talk about the easy way. The easy way is to make me as your mentor so that I get to teach you everything I have learned in Revit architecture. And in the process of using Revit, if you come across issues that you cannot understand, it is just a question of sending me a message on WhatsApp or giving me a call and in one minute I will put you through and the problem will be solved instead of wasting time all right that is the easier easy way and apart from that there are other things you are going to be getting from me which I'm going to be explaining later on in this training all right so how will it be if you can work with me directly i get to show you everything i have learned inside revit architecture from scratch until you become an expert in the use of revit okay what if my phone number and all my contact details will be open to you that you can ask me questions anytime and Anytime you are having issue with using Revit architecture, and I will fix it for you. Permit me to introduce to you the course I titled Revit Tutorial Masterclass. And uh, what are you going to be getting inside Revit Tutorial Masterclass? Currently, we have over 96 video tutorials, which are divided into four modules, and the cost of this video tutorial alone is worth 100,000 naira. Now, let me open my computer and show you the student area. Let me open the student area and show you how it is when you gain access to this Revit Tutorial Masterclass. This is how it looks. This is an introductory video and these are the videos now all these you are seeing they are clickable for instance if you click on this now it's going to take you to that video you can see this is a video all right and this is the download button okay so we have several videos we have Revit tutorial the true understanding Revit user interface. We have Revit tutorial the four modified dimension tick and chain project unit. We have Revit tutorial the five how to create levels, define heart of element in Revit. We have the six how to produce a building plan in Revit architecture. Now this is page one. If you want to go to page two, you simply click on this arrow and it will take you to page two okay now we are in page two the seven how to solve revit family not loaded part one the eight loading revit family from one project to another the nine how to place doors and windows in revit and the ten how to write the names of the spaces in your building the 11 how to create first floor plan in Revit. The 12 how to create package cutting wall ATC. The 13 how to use extrusion. The 14 how to create grid in Revit. The 15 how to create coping. The 16 how to create glaze handrail. The 17 how to create landscaping in Revit. The 18 how to create staircase. The 19, how to create fence railing. The 20, how to create wall groove, and so on and so forth. For the sake of time, I will not be able to go through all the topic in this training. All right. So this is the student area, and this is how it looks like when you have been given access you will be added to our whatsapp and telegram community and this community is amazing because it's a community of architects 
civil engineers and builders. And a lot of my students that are in this community, they get to get a job from each other because architects need jobs from civil engineers and civil engineers need jobs from architects. So we collaborate together and we work together and that group is amazing. So once you have been given access, you will be added to this community and the worth of this community is 50,000 Naira. And it does not stop there. You will also have access to my contact. You can call me anytime you are having issue and I will fix it for you. For you to have access to my private line is worth 100,000 Naira. Okay? I do not expose my private line to strangers, but once you are given access, you have direct access to me to call me anytime you are having issue with your Revit. Now, if you calculate the total value you are going to be getting from this course, you are getting 250,000 Naira worth of value. For this kind of value you are getting, so much value, what do you think I should charge for this course? So much value to gain from this course and almost nothing to lose. And currently, I'm not even charging anything close to 200,000 Naira. Not even 100,000 Naira. And somebody is already saying, then how much is it? And I'm not even charging anything like 70,000 Naira. As of today, I am giving away this course at almost for free. That is 30,000 Naira only. And this price is for today. As long as you are in this training, you can have this course at 30,000 Naira only. I cannot guarantee you tomorrow or next tomorrow or next week or next month. But as long as you are here today, you can get this course at 30,000 Naira only. And very soon, I am going to increase the price because so much value is being given out here. And it is just for a limited number of people. It is not everybody that is, can get it at this price, okay? So when the number that I want that I can attend to conveniently, when that number reach, I am going to move the price upward to something like 40,000 Naira, 50,000 Naira, or even 700. And so if, if, if you want to get it at the lowest possible price, then today is the right day to get it. When you are getting it today, you are getting it at 30,000 Naira only. These are frequently asked questions that people get to ask me every time. One of the questions is, what is your course syllabus? What am I going to learn in this course? And my answer is, quickly let me run through what is contained in the syllabus. Understanding Revit user interface, preparing Revit drawing environment using existing project as a template, how to start new Revit environment from scratch, how to customize Revit shortcut and hotkeys, advanced Revit modeling techniques, how to attach wall to roof and cut wall to roof technique to clean up upper part of the wall to roof, how to convert Revit drawing to PDF and send to clients, how to model building with Revit architecture step by step part one, how to create concrete fissure using sweep, how to move things around, four ways to move things around in Revit architecture, the basis of working drawing in Revit and how to produce working drawing, and how to edit and customize grid bubble section here in ATC, how to create title block, how to place drawing on title block, how to import drawing from AutoCAD, how to export Revit drawing to AutoCAD, 3ds Max and Lumion, how rendering in 3D view in Revit, rendering 3D view in Revit, how to use Revit tools, how to reload Revit families, how to create doors and windows schedule, how to use V-Ray for Revit, 
Revit Martin, and many more. I cannot even list everything you are going to be learning in this course, all right, for the sake of time. And the second question that a lot of people always ask me is this, what is your course and duration of learning? And my answer is, because this is a video training, the duration does not matter because once you are given access, once you have made your payment, you'll be given instant access. And from that moment, you can start downloading the videos so that the video is now residing on your own computer. And because it's residing in your own computer, you have access to it as, as long as you want to. All right. But as for my website, where those videos are, are embedded, my website will be live at least for a minimum of one year. So I believe within that one year, you should have downloaded all the video calls and you can have access to them. And the speed at which you get to know them depends on how much time you devote to it. If you can devote enough time to it, then I can guarantee you that within one month or within three weeks, you must have mastered how to use Revit. The price depends on the time you are gaining access to this course. All right. If you choose to gain access to this course today, then you are going to be getting it at the current price of today, which is thirty thousand naira. But if you choose to postpone your decision, maybe something like next month or next week, then you are going to get it at the price of that time. You probably by next week have increased the price to fifty thousand naira. That means you are going to get it at. 50,000 naira. So the price totally depends on when you decide to gain access. And you are going to have access to all the training materials for at least for a period of one year and have my contact. Within this one year, you can ask me any question regarding how to use Revit. Everything you need to know about Revit architecture. And the third question is, how is the class run? The third question is, how is the class run? And the answer I normally give them is, this is a video course. This is a downloadable video format. The video can be downloaded to your computer so you could watch them at your leisure hour. And we also organize Zoom meetings for all the students to clear every dark areas they are finding it difficult to solve, all right? And the fourth question is, what is your location? Do you have physical class? And the answer is, yes, I have physical class. I have an office, and right now I am in my office. But the price for a physical training is not a flat rate. It depends on the number of people that are picking it at a particular time. So if you are picking it today, you want a one on one class, you want to come to my office and learn based on one on one, then ensure you drop it in the comment section and also contact me on WhatsApp so that I can give you the price for the offline training. All right, if you are getting this course today, I am going to be rewarding you because you are taking fast action, and that is what I call fast action bonuses the, the number one of them is revit installation software i am going to be giving you my own copy of revit installation software and the version that you are going to be getting are revit 2015 revit 2017 and revit 2023 and I am going to be showing you how to install it by yourself. You don't need any technician to do this for you because I'm going to be showing you how to install it and register it and you can use it as long as you want to use it. And the second bonus that I'm going to be giving you is Acrobat X Pro. Now, what is the use of Acrobat X Pro? Acrobat X Pro is used to combine drawing like you have multiple pdf files you can use it to combine it to make it one document and send it to your client like you are seeing here these are several pdf files you can combine it to be just one document 
is more professional that way and you send it to your client and another use of acrobat x pro is it is used to convert drawing to pdf so that you can send it to your client because you may have revit in your own computer and you have already done the drawing you want your client to have a look at it your client may not have revit in his own system and even if he has it in his own system, he may want to view the drawing on his phone. So when you are able to convert it to PDF, he can conveniently view it on his phone. And after viewing it, he can give you feedback and you continue your designing. All right. So you are going to be getting this software for free if you are getting this course today that you are attending this training. All right. And the words of this Acrobat X Pro is worth 403,500 Naira. Go and browse it on the internet. You see the current cost of this software. But if you are getting Revit today, you are getting everything for free without paying a dime. You only need to pay for my course. And that is all. You are getting everything I am listing now. Alright? And it does not stop there. Fast action bonus three. You are going to be getting this project for free. I'm going to be sending you the Revit file of this project. And this is a project I did for one of my clients. And the worth of this project is worth 100,000 Naira. You can learn how I model certain things in this project. And you can also edit a few things and send it to your client and boom, your client pays you and <laughs> without going through the stress of designing, alright? So this is what you are going to, one of the things you'll be getting and it does not stop there. We still have fast action bonus number four. And this bonus number four is nothing but my own Revit families. I will be giving you my own Revit family that I've been using over the years. Some people always complain that when they try to load windows or doors, Revit will be complaining that the Revit family you are trying to use is not loaded. So as far as you are concerned, if you are getting this course today, that problem is solved forever. You are not going to have that kind of problem anymore because I'm going to be sending you my own Revit family and all you need to do is to load it into your own Revit folder and start using it immediately and I'll also be showing you how to load it into your own Revit folder and once you have gotten that knowledge that knowledge stick with you forever and if you calculate the total value you are getting from the bonus alone the bonus is a loan is worth 734,000 naira. That is amazing, right? So let's do a little mathematics here. You remember the total value you got from Revit course is 250,000 naira. And the total value you get from the bonuses is worth 734,000 naira. The bonuses is even more valuable than the course itself. Okay? So and that is to tell you that I am rewarding those people that are getting it today. Alright, so if you are getting this course today, you are getting the worth of this value. Now, if you sum it up together, you see that the total value you are getting today is worth 984,000 Naira. If you are getting it today, that is very close to 1 million Naira. And how much am I selling it? I'm selling it for only 30,000 naira. That is almost free. And even at that, some people will still say it is expensive. Now, let me ask you a question. What is the cost of losing a job due to not being good enough at using Revit architecture? What is the cost of losing a job? If, for instance, you are invited to submit a quotation or you are invited to attend an interview, and you have submitted your CV, you have submitted your portfolio, and your employer to be go through your portfolio and your CV 
and it's, he does not really like your production, your presentation, and tells you that I will get back to you and never get back to you again, and you have lost that job, and probably the job would have paid you one hundred thousand naira per month, and that one hundred thousand naira per month for a year, you would have earned. 1.2 million naira, but you lost it because you were not good at the use of Revit architecture. Now, what is the cost of losing this particular job? The cost of losing this particular job is 1.2 million naira, and this is what 30,000 naira would have sold easily. But some people will not think like that. All right, now what if you are a business owner, you have a company. You have a registered business and you are invited to tender a quotation and you tender a quotation and your client to be looked at your job and is not very pleased with your presentation and tells you back and tells you that I will get back to you and unfortunately never get back to you again because most clients if they want to give you soft landing they will tell you I will get back to you and of course not all of them get back all right and you end up losing that job what is the cost of it this is the co the job that would have paid you 1 million naira 20 million naira but you lose it what is the total cost of losing that particular job that is 20 million naira and this is what 30000 naira would have solved today all right but still some people will not think like that and that is why we have different types of people in the society now the minimum i should have charged for this course should have been fifty thousand naira if you compare the total value you are getting but i just decided to give it out at thirty thousand naira only and if you convert that thirty thousand naira to us dollar as of today that is you are getting it at 70 us dollar only and that is if you are not from nigeria if you are from nigeria it is thirty thousand naira if you are not from nigeria convert it to us dollar that is about 70 us dollar all right and this is the this is my account detail this is the only account detail i am providing for you to make the payments and you can make a bank transfer to this account and this is the only account that is receiving payment for this course. All right. Ensure you make a bank transfer to this account. Omat Le Timothy Obora is the account name. And the bank name is Guaranteed Trust Bank. And the account number is 0164411691. I call it again 0164411691. One six nine one. All right, and after your payment, send your proof of payment to this phone number on WhatsApp. And once your payment is received, I will give you instant access. Okay, so that is where we come to the end of the training today. I am happy you stay with me to the end of this training. Thank you for attending this training and I am so glad you were there for me. If you are not here, I will not be here. Now I want to attend to questions that maybe the video didn't answer. So if there are still some questions you are having that the video did not answer, ensure you drop it in the comment section so that I will attend to it right away. All right? and. If you have not yet subscribed to this channel, on this channel I create content on how to use Revit architecture. If that is the kind of knowledge you want, you want to upgrade your skill on the use of Revit architecture, ensure you, you hit the subscription button and ring the notification bell so that anytime I upload videos about Revit architecture, you will be notified. And you take a look at it and upgrade your skill and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up so that YouTube algorithm will show this video to more people who 
will know that this is a channel that creates content about Revit. All right, see you in the next training.